What's up guys, Michael here. In this video I want to go through all the available resets for your iPhone with iOS 16. I'm currently using the latest iPhone 14, however the steps will be the same for any iPhone with iOS 16. These steps will be particularly useful to you when you're having all sorts of issues with your iPhone like performance issues, glitching or freezing issues, phone just not responding at all, or your phone's having a black screen. Let's get started. A soft reset on an iPhone would be considered powering it off and on. To do that, simply hold one of the volume buttons and power buttons together until you see the slide to power off slider. Alternatively, you can also go to settings, general and shutdown option. Move the slider to power off device. Once powered off, hold the power button to turn it on back again. The next reset would be very useful when your screen is not responding. This force restart of the iPhone will not remove any of your data. To perform it, first press once on the volume up button, press again on the volume down button, and then hold the power button. The screen will go black and you can let go of the power button once the Apple logo comes up. For the issues where your device is still not responding and you can see a black screen, I'd recommend plugging your iPhone to the charger, letting it charge for a couple of minutes and trying again. Should none of the above steps fix the issue, you could perform a factory reset on your iPhone. This will remove all your data and it's a quite useful step when selling or giving away your iPhone. To do that, simply go to settings, select transfer or reset iPhone and press on erase all content and settings. You can also perform factor reset via iTunes application on your computer or Mac. This step is even more invasive as it will reinstall the iOS operating system, which sounds like a good try when you're completely out of options. Using the USB lightning cable, Connect your iPhone to your computer. Run iTunes on your computer to which your device is connected. Select your iPhone and click on Restore in the Summary panel. All the data will be erased and the latest iOS version will be installed in your device. If none of these steps work, then the issue is most likely hardware related. I would recommend contacting Apple support and checking with them what's the best course of action to have your iPhone repaired and fixed. To sum it up, for tackling all minor issues in your iPhone, the first two methods can be used. You can choose to soft or hard reset your iOS 16. With these options, none of your personal important data stored in your iPhone will be lost. The third method to completely reset your iPhone should be used only when your phone is showing critical operational issues. After factory reset, the latest iOS version will be installed on the phone and if required, you can always download the backup. If this video helped you anyway, I'd appreciate leaving a like and subscribing to the channel. I'll talk to you in the next one. Cheers!